What's cracking, everybody? It's your Uncle Seven Nine, the Spiritual Savage. <laughs> that nigga crazy. I don't understand. Listen, you saw. You just that's 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 some funny shit to be. Look. Oh my God. Let's give some thanks to my dad, the Most High, for bringing us here. Uh, things do get better, you know. The moment you realize everybody's in on it, you know, it's just, I'm not going to lie to you. I was almost in tears about 30 minutes ago because I just got so fucking angry. But then I realized that when I get mad and angry like that, that I get another gray hair and a wrinkle in my forehead. I decided, nah, 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 nah niggas, you don't win like that. I can spare a couple of them, though. People are fucking disgusting. Like, seriously, just fucking scabbits. Fucking worthless, insignificant, empty vessels that are just space holders for bullshit. I'm, I'm going to get a practical witch spell card out. Let's see what we're talking about here. Thank you, Dad, for bringing us here to commune with the divine. Be divine. Thank you for these moments to vent. Because, you know, that's one thing I, I'll say. Look, listen, I try to, I, I bring I bring positive energy and good energy to my channel. But I'm also a real ass motherfucker, too. I'm not going to have a channel where I'm just sitting around mad and bitching and moaning and complaining all the time and venting. But, you know, when it's necessary, it's necessary. Because if I don't talk about it, I'm going to get on a bus. I'm going to take a car. I'm going to have somebody come to my house and I'm going to beat the fuck out of them. Or spit on somebody I should never ever spit on in my entire life. You feel me? And I said it in my previous video. I'm not dragging these people because life is already drag day ass. And if they and if it hasn't, it's about to. But me dragging these people is the worst of the is the is so well, for some people to to hear what the fuck I really gotta say when I get the absolute truth scares them more than going to fucking jail. Cause they know this mouth is fucking lethal. Because it's the truth and the disappointment in my voice, the hurt, the anger, but the disappointment, the fact that they disappointed me, they ain't going to hear that shit. They don't want to see it on my face. Let them bitches hide because I'm, I'm still going to move forward anyway. And nine times out of ten, I'm probably not even going to say I don't even want to. I already told law enforcement through this page if I don't even want to see y'all for at least a year after this shit is done and over with. When all you motherfuckers go to jail. Um, yeah, you know, um, you know, on these, on the, on the, on the, like the date lines and shit, when people set up hits and then they, and then they go tell the people, um, yeah, the, uh, they, the police go visit people like, we got some bad news for you. Such and such is passed. You know, was shot and murdered. It's like, oh my God. But they don't want to set the hit up. I got it. When I was in the kitchen making me something to eat, I got a vision in my head that that's what happened to some, to somebody. Like they had a whole meltdown, like, oh my God, what? And then they're the one that sent the hit. Something like that happened. Maybe not for me, but for somebody. But then you have to ask yourself, why are you, why are you angry? Why am I angry? I'm angry because people are that stupid and fucking selfish and evil. Because they got to have it all. I'm about 100% sure every single person that has gotten an inheritance stolen from them, some land stolen from them, a house, a birthright, would have gladly shared with everybody in their family, even if they didn't deserve it. But they have to have it all. And it's not about them having it all. Let me rephrase that. It's not about them having it all. It is about you not having anything. Isn't that something? Tranquility incantation. <laughs> Woo! Come through spirit. <laughs> For inner peace, take a walk in the woods and bring a stick, seven leaves from an ash or oak tree, several, uh, several stones and matches. With the stick, draw a circle in the ground and mark four directions, north, east, south, and west. Arrange the stones and leaves at the center of the circle and say, 
Good luck rises for me in the east. My music rises in the south. My wishes rise in the west. From the north, peace and calm will come to me. All my, and my dreams will come true. And so it is. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to read that last part again. Good luck rises for me in the east. My music rises in the south. My wishes rise in the west. From the north, peace and calm will come to me. My dreams will come true. And so it is. Tranquility incantation. <sighs> Thank you, Holy Spirit. The relationship I have with, with, with the divine is very is very magical and very precious and sacred. You, you ask for things and they give them to you. It's granted. Okay, well, no, let me not even go there. Some things I just worth keeping to myself or when I'm not recording. You feel me? If you know, you know. All right, so back to what I was saying. Yeah, they just don't want you to have shit. And that's fucked up. That's some fucked up. That's some bullshit, G. Okay? It's bullshit. Um. So, yeah. I, you know, I'm not, I'm not going to lie. You know, um. I'm about, I, I, I definitely, I'm all about love and light, but I don't, I want the, listen, there comes a point in time where you, where you have to really accept the idea that these motherfuckers are not, they can't get rehabilitated. There's not going to be anybody getting any better. They sealed their fate. They're fucking evil and they should be evaporated, removed or destroyed. Or at least there should be a permanent restraining order for the rest of my motherfucking life. When it comes to these people, they shouldn't even be able to say my motherfucking name without going to jail. You feel me? Take that energy as it resonates. And uh, yeah, next, next. I believe. <laughs> Ancestors are funny as hell. Okay. Okay. Ancestors are hilarious to me, especially the ones that got access to my Timeline. Well, not my timeline. My recommended videos. Why the fuck do they keep popping this weird, retarded ass, cloned version of me in my twenties on my time on my recommended uh, video list? I don't listen. I I I, too, I watched for a second and I said, "This is." I see why my ex stopped fucking your ass. <laughs> ah shit. I see why that nigga's like, damn, I need to go back to Dwayne. I'm just saying. Damn, be yourself. Be original. I'm, you know what? And that's why I don't be tripping about like the number of subscribers and shit like that. Because, listen, I would much rather have a room I have, would have a room where there's 10 people that get my conversation and we can learn something from each other and, and it's and it's and it's full of sustenance and substance, something you can leave with. Then a room of a thousand fucking people sitting around who are fucking retarded and stupid and soulless. Okay. <laughs> I, it was painful to watch though. I said, "Do because you know I had to ask myself." Eight forty-four o'clock. You're protected. That's, do I really do that? Like I'm sitting around watching. Like I don't do that. Do I do that? Maybe I do, but uh, but it's me doing it. You know, it's my thing. Baby. Any, and that's one thing I will say about, about the, the narcs I've been with. They know the real thing, baby. Okay? Listen. Now, some of the people, they don't, I ain't go front. Some of the people that, you know, these people stepped out of me on. They were some hot-ass motherfuckers. I ain't gonna lie. Banging-ass bodies. Nice skin. Pretty teeth. Pretty hair. Yeah, I mean, for the most part, yeah, they was, you know, there's some. I'm not, I'm not no hater. I, I get, I give it, give credit where credit is due. And if the mother don't like my my introduction or my little monologue before I pull cards, fuck you. I don't care. This is a this is, I do what I want to do on my channel. You feel me? At least it be about some bulls. At least ain't. At least it's not full of bullshit. Okay. Everybody always got see that's what I'm saying. Like I you know what I need? I need a I need a fucking I need a big fat fucking joint, a launch, a, a, a beach chair, 
in a in a fucking sunset or a sunrise in a nice warm place. Otherwise, we have a whole fucking total recall on this bitch. You feel me? Somebody's made a decision. They're no longer at a crossroads. They're no longer not seeing something. You feel me? They see everything for what it is. They're, they know how to move forward. Okay? We got the Hermit to the Page of Cups to the Queen of Cups. However you want to look at it. Somebody's pregnant. Um, maybe with a... It could be a physical... Somebody's having a baby. Somebody has having a spiritual baby. But somebody, somebody's pregnant with something. I just heard pregnant with possibilities. I don't know what that... I don't know who that... That could resonate with the Cancer Scorpio or Pis or Pisces. Because it's Queen of Cups. Okay? That's just a side note. But somebody is moving forward with something. It's a, it, you know, it's a sad day that, just to tell you where the, the, the litmus, the litmus test on people in their, in their righteousness or their spirituality or their overall, um, overall, um, goodness or intelligence even. That may, and it may sound like I'm talking shit because I am, t I'm, t I'm talking shit, but I'm telling the truth. It's, it, it seems as if uh, people aren't, don't want to participate in things that are uplifting or, or, or that will help them grow spiritually. It just seems like it, people will more. I'm telling you, I thought about it today. Do you know how many people would sit around and watch me if I was if I was on here uh, bashing, just like being so karmic and just being so full of drama? I just, I mean, that's upsetting to me. I don't even watch videos like that. I can't. What's somebody making a decision to do? I'm about, I mean, to be honest with you, I'm just, I'm pretty, I'm probably, listen, I can't, I, I cannot rest until I get justice. So every day I will come on here. I will post videos that I'm going to do that. Well, listen, let me just say this. I do this because I feel like I'm, well, I'm supposed to do it. However, which way I do it. And every day that I get up and I, and I have to, and I have to grip my teeth through, through the shit that I've gone through and, 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 and remain, and I hold on to that high vibe energy. That high vibe and spirit that I have, that is above me. I have to give that back. I have to help other people get that, maintain that same thing. Because these injustices are full of shit. And I'm not going to rest until I get fucking justice. And every day I get on here and I show my face and I make sense and I predict things or I read cards or I'm intuitively tapped in or I'm telling, I'm, you know, I'm doing my, my thing. I'm doing the spiritual savage thing. It shows these narmics, these people that wanted me to suffer, these people that wanted me to go into hiding, people that wanted me to shut up, these people that wanted me to be dumb. They wanted me to be the project. They, they wanted me to embody the projections that they sent me, that they told other people I was. Every day I come on here and I say, and I say something and I smile or I, or I cuss and I fuss. It shows them that they haven't won. It's, it's, it's not it's not. It's not, it's not how you, it's not the clothes you put on, it's how you show up and what you got on. You feel me? We have the three of cups. Somebody's making a decision to walk away from some friends. 
They're actually getting far the fuck away from some friends. Why? Or three women, three women in a family? Like sisters, a mother and two sisters, I'm seeing? Oh, was that the devil? Well, we got the three of cups and we got the three of pentacles in the reverse. Maybe three people that they work with. Somebody's made a decision to get away from three people that they work with. We do have pentacles here. The knight of pentacles in the reverse. Um, they weren't, they, they just left. They just had, they just bounced. They, and they got away very quickly. They just walked, they just wait. I don't, I, something happened. What happened? This left a Queen of Wands energy in regret. A man was in a poly, like a polyamorous uh, situation. Somebody was pregnant and lost the baby or did or, or or got rid of the baby. Somebody definitely was pregnant and got rid of the baby. You see that? That's the four of swords. They day to day were not going. They didn't go through that. Was a, they, listen, or they lost the baby. This queen of wands, that's why they're in the regret. What? The devil in reverse. I Listen, in the world. Somebody set up this dude to get to have a baby. They work together. Here they go again. Here goes the lady. They were working to trap this dude with a baby. And she got pregnant, but she lost the baby. Yep, the tower. The tower to the devil. Nope. God said, nope. Getting rid of that devil. This was a this was this was some type of uh, you know, bad seed. Somebody got pregnant and tried to trap somebody with a baby. What did I say? Mm-hmm. Judgment for this baby mama. They go to Empress. That's a mother. That's a mother energy. I know it's in the upright, but it's a mother energy. I said it, a mother and two and two women or something like that. A mother and a mother. Okay. Because it's three of cups. This is a mother and her two daughters. A mother or, or some type of mother figure and her two daughters. Tried to set up this night, this night of wands energy. Just a younger dude too, but he got the fuck on. He dipped. He made a decision. He because at first he was trapped. He was blinded to what they were doing. But in the reverse, this is you know the blindfold comes off. They're no longer at a crossroads. As soon as he saw a way out, he got the fuck on. He didn't. He didn't listen because this is slow and steady wins the race. It made a very quick decision. Wasn't even prepared to leave. I'm picking up the fact this motherfucker just got the fuck on, away from listen. Cause now these people don't this 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 empress energy, this mother energy, this woman that was pregnant, she don't know what to do now. Cause now bad judgment is upon her. Judgment has been called. A judge a judgment has been made. So now now she lost the baby. She doesn't know what to. That's why she's in the regret. That's why she's in regret. She lost the baby, and that's when he left. She was. She kept. She was trying to keep the baby to have him to keep him trapped. I can't make it up. They go to Eight of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Trigger says that's the motherfucking truth. No. I'm trying to tell you, look, she got caught. She had already manifested. Look, she she tricked him. This is like manif manifestation. Page of Pentacles, making an offering. She made a sacrifice to get pregnant for that coin, but she got caught doing that shit. And Spirit said, nope, not doing that no more. Nope. Bad manifestation. Queen of Wands. This could have actually been a side piece too because the Queen of Wands is, is generally somebody's side piece. 
Just saying, she just is. She can be, even if she's upright, upright or the reverse. It just depends on what kind of side piece she is. You know what I'm saying? You feel me on that? Here goes the helicopter, 959, 959 on the clock again. Yeah, he left, he, he got the fuck on. This dude did, what else you want us to know about this? Why are we talking about this spirit? Who needs to know this and why? Why, do, why, why does somebody need to know this? So this is this is for whoever whoever was with this person. Yeah, your relationship ended because of that because it caused a huge fight. I'm trying to tell you. Yep. Maybe had an engagement that you called off. Yep, cuz I'm trying to tell you he was lying doing some type. You probably you probably were Why do you need to know this though? Whoever needs to know this. I don't get it. Why do you need to know this? Did they ghost you? Did you do you not know why they, you know, broke things off with you? Maybe 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 yeah, you well, they didn't ju yeah, they stopped juggling you what you get. Yeah, well, the juggling. There wasn't any juggling anymore. I know that, but Why does this person need to know this? I I, I don't get it. It's important. I guess it's important. You know, because I like I, I don't really like to just listen because you already know why the motherfucker left you. Maybe you didn't. This could be a prediction. <laughs> or maybe you don't know this yet. Yeah, somebody just went cold and they in, they maybe broke things off or I don't know. I'm picking up because this was a whole plot. This person could play sports. This is sound like some sports player or some rich guy kind of shit. Because ain't nobody just going to have sex. But, you know, really, are people really trying to keep babies by broke ass niggas? I'm just saying. I don't know if people do that no more. Because he got good hair kind of shit. I mean, really? Things got cold real fast between you two. You thought this person was... He left you. Or, or, I don't I don't understand what this is. Listen. You were celebrating. You guys weren't engaged, but there was, you know, you guys were you guys were pretty hot and heavy. Maybe you dated for a while, but that ended. Uh maybe they started a, okay, they started a fight to end the shit. Maybe something happened. This is what it is. Okay. This is what happened. They started a fight. Because this is this is the ten of swords to the lovers to the five of wands. That's starting a fight. Ended it. Everything ended because of a fight. And you said, fuck that shit. I ain't with it. Whatever it was, you said no. But there was some illusion there. Now you're seeing through the illusions. He actually walked off on you because this bitch was pregnant. He didn't want to tell you that. But I'm picking up on the fact he's on his way back to your ass. Nine of Pentacles in the reverse, cause he, yeah, he re look, he's looking for your ass. He was looking for he. This is single, self sufficient, independent. This is no longer single. Listen, I'm trying to tell you, he's coming back your way quickly. Who are we talking about here? I'm about to get out of this. Y'all gonna take my ass to bed. Nine one nine on the clock, Tennessee. Maybe somebody's in Tennessee. God damn it. Okay. You don't expect this. He's coming in with a proposal real quickly. He's coming in to propose to you real quickly. Yep, because he's a walk. He walked away from that situation. I'm trying to tell you. He walked away from a Queen of Cups. Cancer. I, she, she came up. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Yep, I told you. The third party broke. He got his heart broken. Or. I mean, it just was a it was a, it was a, it was a heartbreaking situation. It was a backstabbing. It was a betrayal. This represents betrayal. He walked away from all that, and he's on his way to your ass. The Knight of Swords coming to communicate some shit to you real quick. Whoever you are, you don't expect this. You're not expecting this at all. But he's coming back. Okay. Spirit says that's the truth. He's coming back. So he's coming back strong too. You see the you see the you see the wand. Okay. He, he, I'm trying to say this is somebody that plays ball or got some money. He does something. Sports, music, 
whatever. Politics could be, but this dude got a lot of money. He coming in strong. He could be a Leo. Now with the Knight of Wands here, yep, Spirit says that's the truth. He's a Leo. Fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Could be a combination of all three. I don't know. Spirit saying, don't accept it. accepting that proposal gonna put you in the will of fortune in the reverse though. Spirit say don't do it. Listen, keep working on you, keep keep investing in yourself. Spirit say that's the motherfucking truth. Invest in yourself. Make a make a make a head over heart decision as it pertains to this dude. Exactly. Don't do it. Blast from the past. The sun. It's gonna make you miserable, baby. Stay single. Nine of Cups. You're your, your, your own wish fulfillment. You feel me? <sighs> Block that shit. Take a risk on yourself. Take a risk and communicate to him. No thank you. I'm done. Because they're going to come back. He's gonna come, come, listen. He's going to come back. Just, I'm just, He's going to give you the same bullshit. Just in a different way. Spirit said block that shit. And mean what the fuck you say. Be a leader. I'm trying to tell you. Listen. Yeah, and, and block them on social media too. Yeah, don't don't pay any more attention to this motherfucker. Block them on social media. Yep, you don't want to work with this person. Nope, you don't. You let it go. Let it go. Whatever it is, it's not gonna work. So let it go. Spirit wants you to know that. That's gonna be your joy. Let it, it's not going to work. Let it go. You'll be happy. This will be your wish fulfillment. Trust and believe. Go within. Use your intuition. You feel me, baby? Hold yourself accountable for what happens. You don't want to be juggled. He did it before. He'll do it again. That's what spirit wants you to know. I'm getting out of this energy, okay? I hope this helps somebody. Let me get your moonology card and then I'll let you go. There's too much. You know what? I don't. If I never had to be online or do anything, I just I probably would never do it. All this social media bullshit does is it gives people a way to avoid issues, to avoid talking about stuff, to be somebody else, pretend to be somebody else. But then this is the part that kills me. You got all these grown ass motherfucking people in here. See, social media, this the social media teaches it, it, it enables people to become more socially awkward. You got people that have come on here that can perform, make people laugh, sing, pull cards, you know, be be, be all this bold type A personality. But when it comes to like telling the motherfucker how they feel about each other, about somebody, they can't do that. And I get it. Feelings are not easy to deal with. But I just, listen, I don't need that. I'm, I'm real old school. I don't like all this shit. I just don't. Social media, Facebook, Photoshop, all this little dumb shit is what has caused many of the problems I got now. You feel me? Got all these fucking teenagers, they, 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 preteens that develop all these porn addictions, get so caught up in uh, the, the, the evils of the world because their parents don't want to spend no time with it. Their parents are too busy on Instagram and Facebook so their kids are like, oh, what's that? That's porn. And that's the truth. I've had young people tell me that they that's how they... That porn addictions at like 14 and 15. The fuck? We got all these socially awkward, horny-ass people walking around in their 20s and 30s that still don't know how to communicate with people. They get validation from people online. They get all this... These likes, these subscribes, these hand claps, and they get all these different things. So you got all these people that are that like that like them, but the, outside of that, they don't they don't know how to tell somebody that they like them or love them. Because they're not they're 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 afraid they're not going to get that validation out of somebody. That's why or. What if they don't like me? The people that like your videos don't even like your ass. Not no real kind of shit anyway. Prosperity lies ahead, whoever you are. That's it. I, I'm going to continue to keep doing what God tells me to do. You know what I'm saying? I do a lot of things begrudgingly. 
shit. I didn't even want to start this fucking channel. I really didn't. But God told me to do it, so I did it. For a lot, a lot of reasons. More, I'm realizing now I'm glad that I started it, though, because it does. it's not just about me. It helps a lot of other people, and I get that. You feel me? It's supposed to. I understand the bigger picture. But I'm telling you now that... A lot of us are caught up in, in, in things that are not real. And the enemy knows that. I'm leaving this. I'm, 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 I'm not going to close this out. But I just want to tell you, you know, if you're watching this, because I know I got I know I have a lot of people that watch me that are afraid to say something to me. And it ain't even just about love. I'm just saying in general, people don't know how to approach me. I don't understand that shit. I'm not mysterious. I'm very well. There are some things I do keep to myself. And my eyes probably tell that, you know, blah, blah, blah. But overall, I'm not I'm not some I'm not some enigma. I'm just a real fucking person. But social media would have you think that something's wrong with me because I'm a real person. When motherfuckers are motherfuckers is used to seeing fake ass bitches and fake ass niggas and fake ass people, fake ass spiritualists, fake ass preachers, fake ass people. And then when a real motherfucker steps on the scene, people don't know how to take it because it's real. There's nothing wrong with the real motherfuckers. People need to change their perception of what is actually authentic and real in this world. And I'm, and I'm telling you that. Okay? <laughs> the fuck? It's not that hard. That's what that's what it is, and and I'm and I'm not saying none of this to be, to to hype myself. Fuck that! I've been real my entire fucking life. I'm a real person with the real emotions, with real conversation, with. I, and see, that's the thing. I don't know if I think like people are always. I think so, so outside of the so much outside of the box. Do I really, or am I just not in the box that everybody else is in? There's real life that happens off off of these fucking platforms. That's why it's so easy for everybody to believe the bullshit that people say about you or these smear campaigns or the allegations or or these these false ass news reports because it's all pumped into social media and people believe everything that's on social media. They don't know what is around them. People distrust everything around them and believe everything that's on these social media sites so that all this information is pumped into these fuckers. It's the matrix. I don't really give a fuck what nobody think about me. I really don't give a fuck. You feel me? I've attempted to make connections on this motherfucking weird ass platform. I Listen, all I know is this. Okay? The more and more I keep thinking about shit, I'm perfectly fine being by my motherfucking self. Of course, I need help with business, you know, business, business connections. Fine. Let's do that. You know, neutral social. I mean, I'm open to that kind of shit. But, you know, overall, it's a lot less complicated to, to just be to be, deal with be with me because people are so involved in everything else but themselves and the world around them they're too busy worried about likes and shares and comments people applauding them not having no real I I, I look I look at the conversations that that some of these videos have because I that's just me I'm like I'm like a, I am a fucking grandparent I'm a parent I look at shit and I'm just like what the fuck are these people thinking about like this is stupid I'm an intellectual being. You know what I'm saying? Like, what the fuck are... They? Oh, my God, your teeth are so pretty. Oh, my God, your hair is so nice. It's like, bitch, what? Because that's all they can say about some of these people because most of these people are talking about shit they don't even... There's no depth. There's no depth. There's no fucking depth. And it's frustrating as fuck. Because I know I'm not the only one that works really hard. For this, for the whole, for the whole movement of the collective, and I'm sick. I'm really, I'm just really fed up. I'm sick and tired of fake ass shit. I'm sick and tired of fake shit. I'm sick and tired of playing along in this fucking fake ass game when all these motherfuckers need to be evaporated, murdered, killed, or go to fuck to jail. 
That's how I feel right now. Guided with love and light, of course. I'm out of here. Remember, you grow, I grow, I grow, you grow, we grow together. Deuces. Good night, y'all. Have a good night.